They say fishing around the full moon can get you some biggins. I've been watching tactical bassin videos and they said you can fish two days before and up to two days past the full moon or even a new moon and you get yourself on some big, big fish. So today I have the opportunity to fish during the full moon phase with a buddy of mine and we're hoping to get some big fish. I have upgraded my speed demon reel with some ceramic hybrid bearings because some of my subscribers have asked me to do so. Are you guys ready to catch some big fish and watch me catch super duper far? Cause I am, let's go. All right, guys, you guys are probably familiar with this lure. Mystery tackle box. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> oh yeah, first popping frog. Yes, Hoo -hoo. good morning Jimbo. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> ow, 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 ow. Quick photo of this. I like this new frog that I'm using for sure. I can't wait to actually wing my um, my rod out because, like I said, I upgraded the bearings, but right now these bass are pretty much close by to me. So I really just want to keep playing, you know, catch some fish before I test my uh, upgraded bearings. But yes, <laughs> all right. Oh, 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 ow, 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 ow. Yeah. All right, guys, I'm gonna do a long cast because like I said, I upgraded in fact I'll show you guys right here very quick if I can open this cap the bearings right here look at that upgraded bearing the other one is actually right in here it's hard for you to see but I'm not gonna pull my line out it's on a spool I'll just do some overlays but uh yeah man this upgraded thing could make me cast like a freaking mile look at that and it was a soft cast too like I didn't wing it and the funny thing is you guys don't hear that crazy buzz like on my Spartacus. So, um, yeah, I'm gonna, uh, I gotta do like some sort of research and see why the sound is not there. Such an exciting day, guys. I am using this frog right here, popping frog that I got from MTB a long time ago. I just never used it because I'm not a popping frog guy. Yeah, as you guys see, this year is like frog and phenomenal. It's amazing. But uh, yeah, I saw this guy in my, um, bunch of MTB stuff and I just want to you know oh man look at the distance um, use it because like I said it's I'm new to it and also new to these bearings and man it casts like a charm all right I feel like this is it guys oh I knew there was a fish there I knew it I knew it guys. The cool thing about this fast reel is I don't need to use my rod tip to actually do it. I could just reel it in, half turn, and it still pops. Really, really nice. Oh my God. Holy smokes, yo. Holy smokes. Oh my God. Give me that, give me that, give me that. Holy crap. Oops. Holy crap. Holy smokes, yeah. Oh man. Yo, they're engulfing this thing, yo. There you go, oh the rat guys, look at that, holy smokes, holy smokes. Alright guys, I think I'm switching this off because uh, the popping frog is not my game. And they're really in the mats and I think uh, the popping mouth is picking up a lot of weeds. So I'm going to switch my lure, but look at this, I only caught one fish today and one the other day. And it's already ripped up like this, hmm, MTB. What do you say? Huh? You feel it coming? Not here. Oh, 
right there. Uh oh. That's where the money's at, bro. Under the trees. Whoa! 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 Pick her up! No bass! Whoa! Huge bass! Huge bass. Holy bass. smokes! Keep it huge! Keep it down! 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 It's huge! It's huge! Keep it down! It's so... Oh my god! Careful, Jim! Careful, Jim! What the heck, man? What the heck? Holy smokes! Shoot! Holy smokes! Bro! 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 Hold this! Hold this! Oh my god! Bro, this is a six. Dude, it gotta Bro, be a this six. This is a six. It's gotta be a six. Holy smokes. Yo, he choked it. I know, he right, so close. It. He was right in here, huh? Yo. Holy <laughs> wow, that thing is huge. He choked it, bro. Let me take the photos, man. He choked it, bro. Oh my gosh. Oh man, that's crazy. Beautiful. Oof. Oh my god, there's a on that one. Oh my gosh. Like, my hands are small, way smaller than yours, but dang, that is huge. Holy smokes. <laughs> Go back to it, boy! Holy smokes, he was just showing right here! Holy smokes! It was right here! Holy smokes! Literally smoke. right here! Oh my gosh! I told you last time, it would be one right here, man! Oh man! Holy smokes! Holy smokes! Got him! Oh yeah! So far away, but it's a tank. Oh no, it came off! <laughs> Woo! Small little guy. Yo, this is the Canal Street, yo. Where's my buddy? Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! It came from the canal! Hold on! <laughs> bro! Holy smokes! Holy smokes! <laughs> Yo, I gotta grab the other camera. Gotta grab the other camera, man. Holy smokes! Holy oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Frog eater! Frog eater! All right, guys, I'm gonna put this awesome fish back in there. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I got him like right here, like right into that gunk right there. I was reeling it in and I was like, guys, I have to make sure. Let me revive this guy for a second. Oh, there he goes. I gotta make sure I pull all the way into that reeds right there. And he smacked it right on the other side. Like, pow. Yeah. Oh man, that's insane. What a frog eater. Ah, right in there. Oof. Nice. What was that? Ma for me? Yeah. You never know. Oh, there he goes! What? Dude, it's a pickerel, I think. 
What the oh hell? Whoa, it's a pickerel and a half. Holy smokes. Oh my god. Dude, it's a giant. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Dude, 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 dude. Yo, this uh, is the biggest pickerel ever. For sure, ever. man. I saw him dart at it like freaking high speeds. This was what was chasing after your lure. My fingers. Did it get you? Oh. All right. Yep, yeah, walk in there. Do your best. Put in that creek right in the drain. He'll swim out. Bro, look at this. Oh, shit. my fault, bro. Whew. <laughs> you gotta rinse the hand off someone. I know. Ouch, man, dude, what happened right there was I was trying to unhook the fish for my buddy and the pickerel had the rat in his throat very deep and I was holding by his gills just a little bit and I was trying to open his mouth and put the pliers in and then the fish shook and then the gills actually nicked my finger and it wouldn't stop bleeding. That's why you guys gotta be careful when you guys are unhooking fish but sometimes when the fish are uncooperating, sometimes you get the little accident so you guys always have to have some sort of first aid kit and uh, luckily I have some, so that was no problem right there. But man, today was an epic, epic day. I can't believe we landed so many fish. Actually, my friend Jay, he landed most of the big fish. He caught like two big bass and a big pickerel. I only caught like one big bass. <laughs> oh man, but top water fishing during the full moon, it was so awesome. I can't believe it. What are your experiences fishing the moon phases? Have you guys caught any big fish? If so, leave me some comments below. Share some of your stories. And if you guys are on Instagram, feel free to DM me some of your awesome photos. Thank you for watching guys. I hope you guys have enjoyed this fishing during a full moon phase because I enjoyed fishing that day. It was, it was tough, but man, there were some big ones out there. So if you enjoyed this video, please smash that like button. And if you guys are new here, don't forget to subscribe because I will be planning to go back out there. I'm gonna fish probably the new moon phase. In addition, I will try to fish a couple days after those phases and just see how much difference of a fishing uh, there will be. And um, yeah, who knows? Maybe I'll land some big fish. Maybe I'll land less fish. I'm not quite sure what's going on, but you know what? Sometimes you can't just go out there and you know fish whatever um, phase you want because you know you only get fish the days you're dealt right you know there's work there's weather etc etc so uh yeah all i have to say is if you guys have the opportunity to fish during any of the moon phases make sure you guys do and hopefully you catch a big one too until next time guys tight lines